Hello, my name is Maria and this is Mathy, my mascot. In this lesson, we're going to do some more problem solving using the bar models. First, a board is cut into two parts. One part is four times as long as the other. If the whole board is three meters long, how long are the parts? Okay, like I said, we're going to use bar models. So let me draw one here. And this time it happens to be a board in the problem. And we know its total length, so I'm going to mark it here, three meters. And somebody cuts it in two parts, but not equal parts, not right in the middle, but somewhere so that the one part is, or the longer part, is going to be four times as long as the other part. Now, if this longer part is going to be four times the smaller part, then how many parts in total can we think of there being? This would be one part, and then the longer part is actually four parts, so to speak, okay? So that means that I will think of the board as being in five equal parts. Okay, well they are not equal here in my picture, but that is the basic idea. Now the cut is made here, like that. So one part is here, and this longer part is four times that smaller part. And to solve it, we just need to find three meters divided by five. And then we get the length of this one part. Three meters divided by five. How would we do it? It will help tremendously if we change it into centimeters, right? Three meters, 300 centimeters. And then 300 centimeters divided by five gives us 60 centimeters here. So one part is 60 centimeters and the other four times that or 240 centimeters. Now the next problem is made by Mathy. It has some mammoth food there, see? A five kilogram bag of mammoth food costs $15. And a two kilogram bag costs seven dollars forty. You buy both bags to give to your pet mammoth. And later you sell your neighbor one kilogram of both foods. One kilogram from both bags. What should you charge your neighbor? Okay. So you go buy two bags of mammoth food. One is bigger, one is smaller. Maybe the smaller one is some specialty gourmet food. You buy both bags and then you sell one kilogram of the one food and one kilogram of the better food to your neighbor. How much should you charge your neighbor? Okay? I'm just repeating this so, you, so to make sure you understand the problem. You know, Matthew, this one, I think there's a problem with your problem because five kilograms of mammoth food, would that, you know, fill you up? Oh, he's saying, oh no, no, it wouldn't. Yeah. Mammoths would eat much more, okay? So you can think of dog food if that is easier. I said we would solve this with bar models. I'm gonna draw here. This is for the first food. Food one that costs $15 and is five kilograms, okay? So the total is $15, and it's also 5 kilograms. It's 5 kilograms in total. The other one is 2 kilograms. 2 kilograms. Food 2. And it is 740. You give your neighbor, or you sell your neighbor, 1 kilogram. 1 kilogram from here. 1 kilogram from here, or half of this. How much should you charge him? Okay. In case of this, there's two kilograms, $7.40. We just take half of that price, right? Now half of $7 would be $3.50. And half of that would be $20. So $3.50 and $0.20 cents would make it $3.70. And then over here, how much would one kilogram cost? That's easy, isn't it? $15 divided by 5 would make it 
three dollars. And now we just add those two numbers, three dollars and seven dollars and forty cents. We get ten dollars forty cents.